So, EA just dropped Team 2 of Fantasy Foot. We've got a bunch of packs to open. Let's see if we can get something good. For cheap, fast, and reliable foot coins, check out u7buy.com. There is a link in the description. And use the code HABER to get yourself a discount on all of your orders. So, we have got Usman Dembele, Coutinho, Martial, Martinelli, Alexandro, Bamba, Sizoko, Pedro, Rodrigo, Atal, Sirigu, Vertonghen, and Hin Kepai. I believe that's how you pronounce it. It's actually a pretty good team, to be fair. Dembele looks incredible. Coutinho looks sick as well. And he's at uh, Aston Villa. Uh, Martinelli and Martial look really good. It's, it's, a, it's a good team, to be fair. You've got Alexandro there as well. I'm obviously still pretty pretty rough. I'm still pretty ill. But the show must go on. We have my three 84-plus player picks here on my pay-to-win account. And then we've got them on my RTG account as well. So, first one. That is not that is not the perfect link you want to see, realistically. Full English player pick. Lovely. I'll take Harry Maguire. Second one. Eh, at least there's no duplicates in that one. We'll take uh, Sergio Biscuits. Come on. EA, please. Please, Foot Fantasy. Yeah, I'll take an 88 Sergio Ramos. A little bit of fodder. Not the end of the world, to be fair. That's okay. All right, so we've got uh, 82 plus player packs now as well. These weren't great for me before. I can't lie to you. When we first opened these, I think I got like two walkouts in 30 packs or something. Really, really bad like that. But let's open these anyway. And just see if there's a foot fantasy hiding behind there. I mean, realistically, you know, I wouldn't mind. I would like a Martial out of all things, you know. Martial, United boy. I would like a Martial. Um, you know, obviously the, the top ones as well. The Coutinho is the Dembele. Both would be really good. Onana's back in the game as well now. I, I just noticed that. Onana's back in the game. I think he's signed a pre-contract with Inter as well, if I'm not mistaken. He's going to be Handanovic's replacement there, which is interesting. I never realized how old Handanovic was. So, yeah, he's back in the game after a, a lengthy ban. We all know why he got banned from football as well. <clears throat> We're not going to go into that. Google it if you don't know and you want to know. That's about it. Uh, I don't know why I just discarded wide out on there. He was a tradable uh, duplicate. I have no idea why I discarded him. We've got 12,000 thief points as well. I really hope we can get at least one of these. Fingers crossed we can get at least one of these... Uh, Foot Fantasy Team 2 players. Uh, there's a Perisic SBC as well, which is actually pretty decent value. I can't lie. I think the only annoying thing about the uh, the promo, this promo specifically, uh, a lot of the players have been recycled. Um, for example, Dembele got a Rule Breakers. Coutinho got a Winter Wild Card. Martial got a Winter Wild Card. Um, this is okay. I can't know. Tabor got a card. Pretty sure Bamba's had a card this year as well. We had a, we already had a Pedro as well. I think a flashback, which is annoying. Um, EA could be a little bit, you know, a little bit more creative. I think is probably a fair word to use with some of these players. They just kind of give us the same ones consistently. Um, and I get like they try to follow the meta because obviously that's what gets us hyped and whatnot. But yeah, it's kind of like I don't know. It's just. It gets a little bit boring when it's the same sort of headline and players in every promo. Um, and we just end up getting like four different versions of the same card by the end of the year. It's kind of a, it's kind of irritating if you ask me. I wish EA were a little bit more creative with it. But I do get that they've got to try and sell packs and they've got to use certain players to sell packs. But yeah, you know, the bottom half of the of the promo players, you know, the, the 86s and 87s and whatnot, the 85s. They could be completely random players, you know, and it'd be quite fun. But... Alternatively as well, it doesn't have to be household names. I feel like if EA just makes some cards super juiced, they'll be hyped up regardless, you know? Um, I think what was great about the Future Stars promo is there's a lot of players that people didn't... You know, the first ever one of FIFA 19. There was a lot of players in that promo that people just didn't know of. Um, unless they watched a lot of football. And with a lot of promos, to be fair, at the start of, like, SBCs. And then EA just gradually just started using the same players over and over again. It just got a bit boring. We finally get a walkout. First one out of 17, and it's going to be Fabinho. These packs are a no-go. These packs are not it, if you ask me. They are absolutely not it. We've got the last one out of 17. It's going to be nothing. Brilliant. All right, we've got Marshy's 84-plus player picks next. He's got three of them. Let's go. Come on, EA. Ooh, 88 Raheem Sterling. Not bad. That was the Euros final pick right there. <laughs> Italy that makes the World Cup again. And yes, I am still salty, and I will laugh at them, because I, I got enough of it over the summer from Italians and even non-Italians laughing at England for losing so I think it's I think we have earned the right to laugh at Italy for making a consecutive knockout of a sorry not making a, a consecutive World Cup you know eight years in a row that's rough all right he's got an 81 plus pack now for Foot Fantasy Team 2 
and an 83 plus pack. So you'd hope, realistically, you'd get one of them in one of these packs. We'll do the 81 plus first. Come on, show us a foot fantasy, please, EA. Come on. Come on. <clears throat> so walk out. I don't know if these pop up first or not. It's going to be Hubendish, who wasn't playing for Portugal last night. I don't know if he's injured or something. I'm not entirely sure. But Portugal did beat Turkey 3-1 last night. I can't believe Yilmaz missed that penalty. Benassa as well. Ooh, a little bit of fodder, actually. Not too bad. Okay, no foot fantasy in that one, though. A couple 82s. They're not worth anything, sadly. All right, come on. 83 plus. We need a foot fantasy, yay. We really do need a foot fantasy right here. Come on. <coughs> Excuse me for coughing. Come on. Left wing at least? No. It's going to be Edison. Uh, again, do these pop up? Do walkouts pop up first? Or do foot fantasies? I think foot fantasy pop up first, if I'm not mistaken. What else is in there? No way. That can't be it, surely. 288s. Is that it? Or an 89 and an 88. Oh my word, that's that's bad. That is absolutely awful. That is one of the worst 83 pluses I've ever seen. 82 plus times 25 now. Another icon swap pack. And an 83 plus. Hopefully, these are better than the last ones. The last ones were so bad. Come on, EA. Pay out better. Give us a foot fantasy or two, please. Here we go. Come on. Sort us out. It's a walkout again. It's not a foot fantasy. I think we've established that these... The Foot Fantasies will pop up first if you do get one. So, well, I mean, we haven't established we haven't established that because they don't pop up first. I was actually right initially. Um, and that's why I said, I don't know if they do or not. Because <coughs> sometimes they don't. Pedro in there, though. That's not bad. That's all right. All right. Now for the 83 plus times 25. Come on. Let's get multiple Foot Fantasies in one pack. What are we saying? It's going to be an 88 plus, as we hoped. Suarez. An 88 is kind of low for these. I'm kind of hoping for a bit higher than that. Anything else in there? Bigfoot Fantasy Team 2. Ooh, Vertonghen popping up in the first page. That's Is that a good sign? Not bad, though. Ooh, and Bamba. There is two in one pack. Nice. Bamba and Vertonghen. That's decent, to be fair. Bamba looks good. I mean, both cards look all right, to be fair. That is pretty decent. You'll take that. Three, three untradeable there out of two packs. That is nice. W. 384 plus player picks and three one of five foot champions player picks. We'll go from the foot champions right to left. I forgot who's in this week's team of the week, to be fair. Pellegrini, first one, not bad. 84. That is bad, to be fair. You want higher than 84. <clears throat> who's even in this week's team of the week? Is, is Ronaldo in this one? I've, I've been... I don't even know, to be honest. He's not, is he? I don't even know who's in this. Only Son? Ooh. Can we get Son, EA, please? <coughs> No, we cannot. We get David Soraya. Soraya Kerry. Nice. 284. That's not good. All right. Come on. 84 plus. Jordi Alba. It's an 86. Not a bad start. All right. Second one. Come on. Come on. That's all 86s. That's not bad at all. All right. We'll take that. Third and final player pick now. Come on, EA. Sort us out. He's got a 91 plus icon. Oh, Bamba, nice. He's got a 91 plus icon in there as well. Okay. All right, EA. So, Bamba there is not bad. We'll take a foot of fantasy Bamba. And he said he's got a 91 plus icon pack. Let's open that bad boy up. See what that bad boy's got, got in store. <coughs> if we can find it. My word. I am still so, so sick. All right. Middle prime icon. 91 plus. Here we go. Come on. Come on. What are we saying, EA? Please. Big, big boy icon right here. Come on. It's guaranteed to be all flares up. I can't tell what that is. Cannavaro Prime, at least? It is. It's Prime Cannavaro. That's not bad. Not amazing, to be honest. It's not amazing. But that's not bad. He's a good centre-back. He's 92 rated. I don't know if he's worth a lot, though. That's the only problem. Is he is he worth much? Never mind. We won't know. It's, it's okay. It's a small W because he's, he's a small man. So, we're going to end off this video with my three 84 pluses on the RTG now. First one, what are we saying? Not bad. We'll get a for Fantasy Vertonghen. Decent start. We'll take that. Second one now. <coughs> he was just a foot fantasy as well. We'll take Marcus Rashford. Third and final one now. What are we saying? 
inform class. Nice. They're actually pretty good, if you ask me. They're pretty good. Uh, if you have enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. Sorry for all the cuts in this video. Um, a lot of coughing, really. But thank you all for watching this video. And I'll see you lads later.